Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be something that I do pretty much every season here on YouTube and that is we are going to go through all of the new stuff for the Christmas collection from Bath and Body Works. So if you guys are excited to hear what is coming out, what is new, what hasn't been released yet, then go ahead and subscribe and like down below and let's get into it. So pretty much everything that I have is from Life Inside the Page Daily Finds. Um, she is amazing. She is on Instagram. She is also on Facebook and she has a blog. Her blog goes into detail about everything she talks about. So I will be reading from her blog and, um, all credit goes to her. I did not come up with any of this stuff. I'm just going to go through it with you guys because I think it's really fun to like get each other's opinions on everything and to see like what you think and what I think. And, um, how cool everything is that's coming out. So I'm not talking about um, Christmas Floor Set 1 because that has already premiered, but Christmas Floor Set 2 and 3, I think there's a second and a third, and then we're gonna talk about some uh, unique things that are coming out for Body Care Day, for um, Candle Day, and then just like in general, some things that are new that we haven't seen before. Okay, so first let's talk about a few dates that are coming up. So the first thing is, of course, Black Friday is coming up very soon. And so actually the sale is going to last the entire week from Monday through Friday. And um, it's not clear yet what exactly is going to be on sale, but just know Black Friday is going to be the whole week of Thanksgiving, which is great because I know last year they gave uh, the employees off for Thursday. And I think Friday they even started, uh, Black Friday they started they opened late and they closed early on Wednesday. So that's really great for the sales associates. They need a break too. Um, and then we have Candle Day, which is the third and the fourth. That is a Friday and a Saturday, the first Friday and Saturday of um, December. Usually Candle Day is the first Saturday in December, but I think they're just going along with the lines of last year um, where they did Candle Day all weekend because of COVID. They want to keep people... Um, from being crowded in the stores so that's really really good of them and then semi-annual sale is going to start of course it always starts the day after christmas on the 26th and it looks like it's going to go through midway through january but sometimes stores will just keep stuff out anyways so that's just like a general overview of dates let's get into some like actual fun dates so the calendar of all the sales and i am doing a screen recording so i'm going to insert that up here and i will just be talking um down here below so right now when I'm filming it, it's actually the body lotion sale day, which is $3.95 lotions on 11.13, but that's already going to be passed once I upload this video. So the next sale is going to be on Saturday, 11.20. It's the hand soap sale for $2.95. I will be participating in that because I need some new Christmas hand soaps, and I'm going to be giving away a few of those as gifts too, so I'm going to pick them up then. Um, Sunday on the 21st is going to be another single wick candle sale day. I hope it's the same price that it was last time. Um, I think it was $8 single wick, so that was... A pretty good deal um maybe it was less than eight dollars honestly i can't remember but um i'll probably pick up a few single wicks as well and then um monday the 22nd through sunday the 28th is the black friday and the big weekend sale days so that's what i said earlier just the black friday sale not sure exactly what that's going to be but we know that it's those dates and then the 29th is always cyber monday so that's going to be 40 percent off the whole store this is your chance to pick up some pedestals i always pick up like either a pedestal or a decoration or like a candle topper on this cyber monday deal deal day um or like the little um bubble baths those are like way too expensive so things like that some unique items that are half price that's a really good time not half price but 40 percent off is still a really good deal um, and then Friday the 3rd through Saturday the 4th, Candle Day. Um, Tuesday, December 7th is going to be the mini sale day. So that includes fun size, travel, lip care, uh, maybe pocket backs. Not sure on that yet. But that's always a great time to pick up gifts if you do travel size body care as gifts, which I do that. Um, I'm also probably going to pick up some more uh, hand lotions and maybe um a little lip gloss because their lip glosses are so cute i have one from last year that i really love the winterberry one so cute and then for friday december 10th that's going to be body care day so i think it's friday through saturday body care day and i um, not sure exactly the price on that but usually it's like five dollar body care or something that is the time to pick up the um, body creams 
or sorry, the body butters because the body butters are usually like $18.50. So if it's on sale that day, and usually they are, that's a really, really good deal to pick up the body butters or again, to pick up those like um, bath bombs or bath, um, bath, bubble bath. Oh my gosh, I couldn't think of the word. Or pick up bubble baths, just like unique items that are usually really overpriced. It's a really good time to pick that up. Also perfumes, if they're on sale that day, it's a really good day. So that's like it for kind of dates of everything. Let's get into all of the body care. So collections that are coming out soon, that's gonna be the faceted collection. And this includes A Thousand Christmas Wishes, which is coming back, Forever Red, and then Magic in the Air on December 10th. So that's what those forms are. They come in all four forms, just the basics. And then a different collection is the Cozy Season Body Care Collection, which I'm very intrigued about this one. So this is gonna be coming out hopefully before Body Care Day um, by December 10th. And this includes Vanilla Mocha Cream, Cozy Sunday Morning, and Whipped Rose Latte. So I'm really excited about the um, Vanilla Mocha Cream because I'm hoping it's Vanilla Mocha Cafe like they had um, last year. We don't yet have the scent notes on Cozy Sunday Morning. You can kind of guess what the Vanilla Mocha Cream is going to be. And also the Whipped Rose Latte is probably going to be some sort of coffee and rose. So those are going to be really interesting scents. This sounds like stuff that's right down my alley. Um, so I'm very excited about that collection and then the last body care collection that's coming soon Hopefully before body care day. We have a first look at this starlet collection, which there is really no um, Scent notes to this. It just looks really pretty um, Maybe this is like playing on the drink theme that they do sometimes so let's get into some candles that they're saving for candle day so uh, Life inside the page daily fine. She said that either these candles will be put out on candle day or they will be saved to replenish stock after candle day so you might not see them on candle day um, but go ahead and make your candle day wish list that's what like that's what Bonnie says to do I listen to Bonnie um, make your candle day wish list and if you don't see these new um, candle day candles in your stores that's okay buy just like a generic whatever one um, that is also 2550 and then go in the next day or the day after candle day that week after and you can exchange your candle for these new ones so that's just like a little tip um, exchanging is not against any policy bath and body which has a really great exchange policy um, just keep your receipt with you and bring those candles in. you can exchange them for these new ones if you don't see them on candle day but this collection looks really good to me i'm so excited so we have give cheer which is strawberry sparkler that's this one right here um strawberry prosecco splash of rose water and vanilla bean oh i'm sorry this is give Com comfort this is give cheer my bad um give comfort is fresh peach sweet cinnamon and frosted vanilla so it's just like a, a peachy gourmand could be really good if you like peaches um, give peace is mahogany vanilla warm vanilla fresh bergamot and sweet sandalwood That'll be a really good one if you guys like kind of more masculine type scents um, I might pick this up for somebody that I know But that would be a good uh, gift for a guy in your life. We have give which is Give warmth up here, which is peppermint marshmallow. I am so excited peppermint marshmallow is my favorite well, one of my favorite Christmas scents for candles. It is such a soft and simple scent. It was an online exclusive last year and I did purchase it and it is so, so, so good. If you like a simple, warm, like marshmallow scent with just a touch of peppermint, it has the same kind of peppermint that uh, peppermint sugar cookie has. Peppermint sugar cookie, excuse me. Um, so if you like that kind of like simple scent, you're gonna love this. So I'm picking that one up for sure. And then we have Give Thanks Fresh Winter Air, which I assume is just some sort of like um, air, aromatic, like fresh scent. I'm not really into those. Um, and then we have Give Warmth Marble Chocolate Cupcake. You guys, I'm so excited for this one. It's sweet cocoa milk chocolate topped with vanilla glaze. That sounds delicious. Give me all the gourmand. I love the like cookie, cupcake, chocolate, brownie, whatever. Oh, 
I want it so bad. So that one is absolutely going to be on my candle day wish list. So that's all for this um, Giving Tuesday collection. And then we have the Christmas plaids candle collection. So this one might be a candle day release or on hold for after candle day, but it's looking like they've got a berry spritzer back again. Um, cranberry Parabellini back again, Caramel Drizzle back again, Cinnamon Clove bug, Buds, Hot Buttered Rum, which is going to be some people's, um, some people are going to be very excited that that is back again. Merry Cookie, of course, Red Velvet Cupcake, and Vanilla Balsam. Really the only one on here that I am dying to try is Red Velvet Cupcake because they, they used to come out with it every single candle day and they didn't the last two years when I was actually into Bath and Body Works. So I really, really want this candle. I'm definitely putting this one on my candle day wish list. The next collection for candle day is Kate's Cozy Luminaries Candle Collection. Okay, whoever Kate is, she's a freaking genius because all of her packaging is always so cute. So the, um, the scents that'll be in this collection are Blushing Poinsettia, Rose Petals, Green Ivy, and Sweet Marshmallow. So if you like a kind of like sweet floral scent, you'll like that one. I am not for floral, so I will not be picking that up. Um, Cinnamon Stick is back. Iced Winter Balsam, which is Frozen Eucalyptus, Sugared Pine, and Fragrant Balsam. Smoked Vanilla Rose, Toasted Hazelnut Praline, which is Hazelnut Toasted Marshmallows and Vanilla Woods. That sounds really good to me. I'm really excited for that scent, so I will definitely be picking that up. Well, maybe if I smell it and I don't like it, but it sounds like something I would like. And then Vanilla Swirl Brownie. I'm so excited. So I actually used to have the, um, I used to have Peppermint Brownie in the Wallflower Fragrance and in something else I can't remember. Um, maybe it was the car fragrance refill, but that smelled legit like you were baking brownies. It was so good. So I'm hoping vanilla swirl brownie is kind of similar to that, but without the, the peppermint part, of course. Um, very, very, very excited about that one. And then the last line for candle day is Kate's Cozy FL Candle Collection. I'm not really sure what FL means. Um, but the scents are Blue Spruce and Spice, which is Blue Spruce, Nutmeg, and Warm Amber. Cozy Cashmere, which is Smooth Lavender, Warm Vanilla, and Comforting Sandalwood. Merry Maple Pancakes, which sounds like a gourmand lover's dream. Uh, Peppermint Marshmallow again, I'm so excited. And Raspberry Mimosa. So I'm hoping um, that the one of those two Peppermint Marshmallows is going to be in store so I can pick it up at Candle Day. But if not, that's okay. Um, the Candle Channel also said that his store um, is saying that there will be the option to buy online and pick up in store for Candle Day on the first day, probably not on the second day. And on the first day of Candle Day that Friday, they are going to be limiting the amount of buy online, pick up in store purchases that their store can do. So try to get there early online if you want to do an in-store pickup. I will try to be doing that because I have a 20% off coupon. So I'm hoping to use that and it only works online. Um, so I'm hoping to use that to buy online, pick up in store. We'll see. Um, but that's everything for that. And so this is just a general overview of everything that she said about um, the collections. So again, we have Giving Tuesday, Christmas plaids, Kate's Holiday Party, which is a new one that we haven't talked about yet, so I'll get into this. Black Cherry Merlot, Black Tie, Blueberry Sugar, Merry Mimosa, Peach Bellini, Pink Apple Punch, and Strawberry Pound Cake. I might pick up Blueberry Sugar because I know somebody who loves blueberry, uh, but besides that, this is all stuff that comes out year to year, so I'm not too interested. I might pick up a Strawberry Pound Cake just because that's like a good scent to have anyways, um, but that besides that, I'm good. Kate's Cozy FL, which we've seen. Um, Kate's Knits, which is new, bow ties and Bourbon, Cinnamon Spice Vanilla, Laundry Day, Cranberry Peach, and Vanilla Birch. So again, these are all ones we've seen before, but I know a lot of people love Laundry Day, so they'll be happy to see that back. Um, we've got Kate's Cozy Luminaries, which we already talked about, but here's a nice um, snapshot of what they look like. And then um, they usually put out a few uh, candles to get ready for spring and summer. So um, the first section is the spring botanicals. We've got sunwashed citrus, fresh cut lilacs, endless weekend, white gardenia, eucalyptus rain, sunshine and daffodils, and cactus blossom. So those are ones that they usually just put out so people can buy for the rest of the year, basically, because that's what regular Bath and Body Works shoppers do is they use Candle Day to buy all their candles for the rest of the year and they don't have to purchase them. Um, but us people who are kind of crazy about Bath and Body Works purchase all year. So, um, and then we have the White Barn Core, I think White Barn CG means White Barn Core Group, I don't know, Spring Seasonal. 
Um, we've got Bubbly Rosé, Paris Cafe, Orange Pineapple Punch, Island Margarita, Bergamot Waters, Banana Bunt Cake. You guys will be happy about that one's back because I know a lot of people love that. Mahogany Coconut, Fresh Cut Lilacs, Watermelon Lemonade, Pink Apple Punch, Tiki Beach, and Lavender Vanilla. Um, none of these really sound that great to me, honestly. Um, probably not going to pick up those, but it's good to have. And then we've got the White Barn Ombre Collection. She spelled it Ombre. Um, Fiji White Sands, Champagne and Orange, which sounds new. Lavender Vanilla, Pomegranate Lemonade, Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit, Palo Santo, and Vanilla and Peach Tea. Some of these are fan favorites, so you guys are going to love this. Um, I might try and pick up a Pomegranate Lemonade because... I picked that up at Candle Day last year, but it ended up smelling like kerosene, and I got really sad about it. So I'll try it again this year, and champagne and orange kind of sounds good to me too, so I might do that. Um, we've got the White Barn Decor Collection, Market Peach, Linen Sheets, Pineapple Mango, Watermelon Lemonade, Tiki Beach, Mahogany Coconut, Eucalyptus Mint, Black Teakwood, Island Margarita, and Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. These are all staples. You guys know about all those collections. We've got the Coastal Getaway Luminaries. This is Berry Waffle Cone, Summer Boardwalk, Turquoise Waters, Coastal Sea, Ocean Driftwood, and Star Fruit and Sea Salt. I think that last one is new, but this looks like that same uh, packaging that we already had for the summer as far as Berry Waffle Cone and Summer Boardwalk. Um, so that's interesting, but if you guys are into those scents and you just want to pick them up now, that's a great time to do it when the uh, candles are on sale. And then we have the Body Care Expansion labels. That's Japanese Cherry Blossom, A Thousand Wishes. Relax, which is aromatherapy, Into the Night, In the Stars, and Men's Ocean. So really excited that they're going to bring out the body care in this collection. It might be an online only or it might be in stores. Not sure, but I know um, that all the body care candles that they have so far currently on sale are online. So this might be an online only. I'm not quite sure. And then we have Single Wicks, Raspberry and Whipped Vanilla, and Pineapple Mango Spritzer. And then some online exclusives are Apple Garland, Fresh Coconut Snowball, and Fresh Sparkling Snow. So that's everything for all the candles and the reviews of everything that's going to be coming out soon um, that isn't quite out yet. I'm sure there's going to be a lot more news. There's more news every single day with the new Bath and Body Works stuff. So if you need to keep updated, you definitely should follow Life Inside the Page Daily Finds on Instagram because she keeps up with everything. Um, follow TMR Tina Marie on YouTube because she does a daily um, candle news network show i love her candle news network every single morning when i brush my teeth i watch that show not that show it's her video on youtube but yes she does it every single morning so definitely follow tina marie if you need to know the latest and follow bonnie as well um, because she always updates with lots of reviews so if you're curious about um, any candles and you're making your list you can do that too so yeah that's pretty much everything for what's coming up um, if you guys want me to do some like advice on uh, candle day and things like that let me know down below um, but I was really excited to go through this with you guys because I really haven't even started purchasing for Christmas yet so it's fun to see what's coming new and what I should put on my list but yeah that's everything for today's video I hope you enjoyed and if you did like comment and subscribe down below and I will see you guys in my next video bye